when you look at this position display you can get any one of these positions individually on the screen at the moment I'm looking at all four and if you're in MDI or you're actually in program they're the four that you'd see now the one on the right hand side which is the absolute the one that says absolute don't confuse this with absolute and incremental what it actually means is it's the actual position that the machine is sitting at now and this is in relation to the work offsets and the tool offsets so if you're sat at a diameter on a lathe of x50 then that's what this will read so and it takes into account all your tool offsets and everything the one at the, on the right hand bottom corner there is your distance to go which I'm sure you'll be looking at this one and this tells us if we're proving out or if we're running a program if we're drilling a hole you will see that distance to go telling us effectively how much distance there is to go so it will count down and you'll be able to press your feed hold as you get closer and closer and you'll see where you're actually going with that uh, now the next one which is this one on the left of that is the machine display what this is is your actual position from zero return you can't change this in any way it's not altered by offsets or anything now you won't be particularly interested in this only if you're setting a datum because that's what will read that position into the datum so when we're looking at these position displays um, we're obviously using them in different ways to interrogate the system depending on what we want on the screen at that particular time so let's first of all move into the jog mode which is where we want to be to do this uh, position setting we're going to press the position button on here which gives us our position display and we've got three choices here we've got the button that says all um, which will show all of the positions we've got the absolute which just shows this absolute position and then the relative which is the one I'm interested in now which is this screen that I can preset to whatever I want so what I'm going to do now is um, I'm going to press the um, the x-axis and then what that will do is uh, set this display flashing and when I press the origin button there's no figure in this but if there was a figure it would actually zero it out so I press the origin it stops flashing and it puts it to zero so I could then if I wanted to if I wanted to actually tell it a position I could put something like X and then say I don't know 32 don't forget your decimal point and then I'm going to now press the preset button which is a preset position so I've now set the X to 32 and then if I take the Z axis I can do exactly the same on Z or this C axis if I want I'm going to origin that it's flashing that would set it to zero um, same thing again I can put um, a figure into the Z which I perhaps wanted to preset I'm going to put 50 in this one don't forget that decimal point preset so when I press that preset set it to 50 so I can just do whatever I want with this I can origin them set figures in them but don't forget the machine is not interested in this um, in this display so it's not used by the machine for anything so it's purely for your use it's what you do with it and, um, and you can use this as a setting tool you can use it for all sorts of things measuring something just moving around um, it's there for your use a bit like your DRO on your Bridgeport machine 